Good evening. I'm Maurice Dubois. And I'm Christine Johnson. We begin tonight with that breaking story. A teen suspect back in police custody after escaping from a Brooklyn precinct. CBS 2's Jessica Layton live in Crown Heights now with new details on how he was caught. Jessica. Christina Maurice, he was on the run for seven hours. He escaped from outside this precinct, then took off sprinting through this intersection where he disappeared into a subway station and was later caught in a laundromat. Moments after the suspect's escape, surveillance video shows him sprinting through the intersection of New York Avenue and Empire Boulevard in Brooklyn. He falls, but gets up surprisingly fast and continues running from the two officers. The 18-year-old arrested on assault charges manages to make it around the corner, where he's seen on the far sidewalk in this surveillance video continuing to run. The officers initially chasing him, nowhere to be found. A few seconds later, we see two NYPD SUVs going down down Sterling Street. But at that point, the escapee, still wearing handcuffs, had already slipped down into the subway station and taken off on a train. That's terrible. That's terrible. So, so they don't know where he went? From about 12.45 to 7.45, they didn't. Chopper 2 captured video of the large police presence on the ground as authorities searched underground for the man they lost around lunchtime. Somebody's not doing a job. Sources say the homeless teen, Franklin King Lindsay, was caught in a laundromat and initially arrested on assault and criminal mischief charges. But after his stunt of getting free from officers at the 71st precinct, a charge of escape has been added to the list. And I hope um, what he did wasn't too bad and he will learn from this and get on with his life. The suspect will spend tonight in jail before facing a judge tomorrow morning. We're live in Crown Heights, Brooklyn tonight. Jessica Layton, CBS 2 News.